All right. You're supposed to tell me this thing. Planes, except we used it. Holy crap, this thing looked a lot smaller in the case. <laughs> no, it wasn't. Oh my god, I'm a heathen. I just ate bacon. Oh, you're going to hell. Hello. So what's up? Happy Friday. We're not at work again. So we are going out of town. Cupertino. Cupertino. It sounds like we can actually get a hotel there now. So, and we already did. First, where are we going? Casey's Donuts in Elk Grove. I gotta get me some sprinkly and crumbly donuts again. Maybe a maple bar. Chocolate bar. Flintstone bar. Do they have Flintstone cereal one? Uh -huh. Flintstone flakes or something like that. Fancy, fancy, what do you got? You got a black mess? Uh-huh. Sheila made me this cool dealie. It's a place to keep my mess. All right, we're gonna go get some donuts. All right, so we got our uh, donuts, but we're gonna save them because we're gonna go get lunch right now at Sonic. Yep. America's driving. Oh my God, I'm a heathen. I just ate bacon. Oh, you going to hell. Well, all my friends are there. It'll be fine. Well, you're supposed to tell me this thing. I ain't Catholic. I don't know. I did egg. You had a what? Egg. Okay, I still, I don't, how can you have an egg but you can't have a chicken? It's the same damn thing. Nah. It's just an unborn chicken. Stubby brought, has a chicken and lays eggs, so she brought me a case of eggs. I think you can tell the difference. My mom says no, but I think so. I wonder if it's because one's been in their fridge and the other hasn't. It could be it. the yolk of Stephanie's eggs that were like huge. I remember there was an episode of the Magic School Bus where they made an egg. They went inside the chicken. More you know. You and your biblical shows. The Magic School Bus is not a biblical show. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Like Ninety-five so percent of the shows you watch are like all of like religiously like. What do you mean? Ninety-five percent uh, Star Trek in the Bible? No, but was that Veggie Tales? That other show you were talking about yesterday? Oh, like, Quigley's Village. That's my childhood right there. Yeah. Crap. What am I gonna eat now? You can eat anything you want. You already <laughs> sinned. Damn. You gotta go be out like that. Yeah. Jesus. We have a bunch of snacks for dinner. My popcorn. Ooh. Oh, do we have chopsticks to eat this popcorn? He was the only person I know that used chopsticks for popcorn. You eat chips with popcorn. I do not eat chips. I eat Cheetos with uh, popcorn. Chips and Cheetos. No, 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 no. Totally different. The pretzel twist is like... I like the pretzel twist. I just don't like it in that. Uh, it's one of the, the greatest creations ever. Got a corn dog. Got two corn dogs. And then I got a chicken slinger and Panda Express. Like six pieces in here. Okay, on your island, you can only have either a Sonic or Taco Bell. Sonic. I only get two things from Taco Bell. Three things. Taco mm -hmm. Supreme, Nacho Supreme, and my cinnamon twist. I don't like nothing else on their menu. I love Taco Bell. They make some of the greatest food in the world. But it's also just all the same. For tweakers. Hi, Jazz. I think when it comes down to it, I think I still prefer a burger over a burrito. I uh, would go Sonic too. Especially after they got rid of the Mexican pizza. That was my favorite part. The, the crunchy. Uh-huh. <laughs> I don't know how you don't like to eat these. Poor the cookies are delicious. They're so crunchy and yummy. So good. All right, where's my donut? I just got a plain chocolate donut today. Look at this. Well, what'd you think of that lunch, babe? It was delicious. Yeah, I'm a little full. I'm a lot full. Yeah. What do you got there? Filled corn. From the popcorn shop. Popcorn store. Oh, popcorn store? Yeah. Ooh. You want your nasty cheese one? Yeah. That's the best one. When do you get those stupid um, cylinders for Christmas? That's the one that we use as ammo to throw at people. That's messed up. 
I'm not gonna waste caramel on them, on people. That's probably the best one to do, because it's the hardest. <gasps> That's the best one to eat, though. That's the one we throw away the most. <laughs> I remember, I had this one on one. One time during Christmas, when we were having family Christmas, this dude gives all the cousins, like, you know, games and stuff. Uh -huh. And he gives me this jug of popcorn. <laughs> like, How's it going, my nephew? I just want to say Merry Christmas and uh, hope you enjoy this. I was like, yeah, all right, cool. And if he does watch, you know who you is. Is so that the what? The zinger. Is that like a Twinkie? No, because it's iced vanilla cake and cream filling. Kind of like a Twinkie, uh, but it's got frosting. <laughs> Popcorn, I had a zinger, and now I'm eating that version. Don't judge me. So good. Have you ever been there? Pete Anderson's? Pea soup, Anderson's. I don't know, the whole idea of pea soup doesn't appeal to me. Uh, I mean, what do you all think? Pea soup, I just think that's like mushy peas in a bowl. And that's why, how I know you've never had pea soup. That's, a, that's why I just said the idea oh. of pea soup doesn't appeal to me. Because it sounds like mushy peas in a bowl. Gotcha. I don't think you can have pea soup. It's got bacon in it, though. Ham. Or ham. Made with ham hock and ham pieces. That's why it's delicious. Yeah, I was about to say, you're not making me feel like I want to get any more than I did before. Definitely not an Advent, is it? It's not an Advent. But it is delicious. Although I remember when we used to serve that on Tuesdays at Mary Candler's, and I thought it was disgusting. Because it's green. I'm like, what the F is this? And then one of my bosses, one of my general managers made me sit there. This man constantly forced me and my brother and all the other kids, because we were all a bunch of teenagers. What are you talking right now? Not making him in a good life. Hold on. He would force <laughs> us to try items that we had never had. Because like we would have stuff on the menu that some of us didn't have, grow up with. And he would make us try it. Everybody had to check. During the week, you had to take one of your shifts and you had to try something new. That was a requirement because most of us were in high school or we were like kids. Sometimes we would like do it all together and try it. We had to try all kinds, everything that we've never ever had before. I did not like veggie burgers. Thought they were gross. What? We had a veggie burger. I had to eat the veggie burger patty with my sandwich. It was like cardboard. It was so gross. I don't like veggie patties to this day. Oh my god, I wanted to die. Oh, and that was a thing because he treated us like his kids. You couldn't leave the break table until you finished your food. I'm pretty sure this guy wouldn't last very long today. <laughs> yeah, so we would sit there and we're like, oh. The one that changed me was I had to try pea soup. Me and Michael had to try pea soup. Michael liked it. He ended up from that point was like, I sometimes have to be in a mood for pea soup. Wait, was it a veggie burger or a garden burger? There's a difference. I think it's the garden burger. Because the veggie burger uses the fake meat. The like garden it. burger uses the patty that's made out of like, that's straight up like, you can tell it's a veggie burger. Made yeah, out of yeah that was garden burger. I thought it'd be garden burger. I like veggie burgers though. No, I think it was garden burger. Cause that's what we called it, garden burger. Well, I could go for some veggie burger and ketchup right now. Okay, put your boring thing on. Not boring. Well, that's that. We're here in the hotel now. Hilton Garden Inn. Check it out. They have a guarantee that no one's been in your room since they cleaned it. All right, so here's our room for the evening. Hilton Garden Inn, Cupertino, California, as you can see. Silicon Valley. Got this microchip right here. Kind of cool. Keurig machine over here. We got a microwave. Yep, yep, refrigerator. We got an Apple TV. I don't know if you can see it, but that's the Apple uh, campus right across the street. The TV's a lot bigger than the last time I was here. Back then, it was like a 32 inch. Wow. Interesting. All right, I'll get all settled in. So our room come with the Apple TV, so you know. Donut wheel, donut wheel, donut wheel. Donut wheel. Donut wheel. Donut wheel. Donut wheel. Late that night too. Wow. That looks good right there. That looks good right there. That looks good. I think Antonio would like that. Whatever, would that be good tomorrow? It's all looks good. What's up? Back here at the hotel, we just picked up dinner. Hello, honey. We're watching the boys. 
We got food. We got, this is from Donut House, wheel. Oh, I keep saying Donut House. We got a <laughs> cronut, four donut holes with filling, your cruller with maple, crummy bar, and my old fashioned. Ooh. Good. This is your Shania. This is your tilapia and beef. Mm. Chicken and beef. Mm. Mm. Looks good. Can't wait. Then we got drinks from the mm. table. Got some tables. Mm. 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 One thing about this hotel, it's not ideal for eating. No. All right, we had dinner. Now it's time for dessert. Oh, which one is, I want to try the, how do we know which one's strawberry or the raspberry? Because look, it's red. Okay. Well, I have a straw, I have a raspberry one. It is a custard filled donut hole. I'm going to have to try the regular one. This is basically a jelly donut. Cream filled. Raspberry is filled. Holy crap, this thing looked a lot smaller in the case. <laughs> no, it wasn't. It was huge. Don't you tell me that. Maybe I'll save this one for breakfast. What is this guy? It's a maple cruller. What's a cruller? It's a donut that's twisted. Okay, ooh, I'm gonna eat this cronut. Is it split? Oh my god, look at this cronut, what the hell? I told you it was split. Mm. I got later. Pretty good. Ooh, that's interesting. Mm. Come on, cronut. Mm. Mm. I get maple donuts all the time, but usually this late, they like crumble. They make, this one looks like it's still wet. I think because it's 24 hours. So they just made them maybe? Mm -hmm. So this is a custard? Mm-hmm. Right. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. No more. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Oh, those are good. Mm -hmm. All you other donut shops, take note, you should be 24 hours. Mm -hmm. All right, what's up? We're done dinner. We're getting ready to go to bed. Just uh, playing with some computer right now and Sheila is cutting fabric to make masks. Here, as you can see. We're about to hit the hay, so catch you all on the flip. All right, about ready to check out. Just gotta load up the car again and we're out of here. All right, got a couple more things back in the room. All right, we have checked out of our hotel and we are now gonna see if we can grab some lunch. What do we got here? A Cheetos, ooh, and a sandwich. Ooh, and I got Sushi, because Kura is only doing indoor dining. I don't really want to do indoor dining yet. And more sushi from Sprout. I thought Sprout sushi is actually really good. Okay. He put it on super, but it looks like. Yeah, okay. But those gonna be white. Maybe that's why it was cheaper than we thought. Maybe. So, what kind of sandwich did you get? Roast beef, but I'm particular. I just like roast beef, pickles, and mayo. This bread is disgusting. What kind of bread was it? It said sweet. Mm -hmm. Mine seemed like a sweet roll. Taste it. It's like pumpkin-y. That's why it's a dollar less. Mm -hmm. Where's the best sushi you ever had? The best sushi I ever had? Mm -hmm. Oh, that's kind of hard. Look at this soda, it's like the same size as me. I don't know what the best sushi would ever be. Because I've only ever had it at restaurants here. And I imagine our high-end sushi here is like the mediocre low-end sushi like in Asia. In terms of the sushi quality, the best one I've ever had. 
the one that we went to in Lodi with Josh and Adriana, uh -huh. that one consistently had the best quality. That was the ones that I tend to go to. That was the one where I got that huge roll. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's definitely not yum. <laughs> yum is a quantity over quality. Mm -hmm. a scale of one to ten for that your sandwich. Five. Out of ten? Mm. I don't like this bread. I'm not even gonna eat this other half. Mm. Well, you're not gonna eat it. I might eat it. Rice is a little dense on these, but maybe it is. The roast beef is so good and the pickles, but the spread is so gross. I don't know if I want my new popcorn or the old one. Only 60 calories for this? The whole bag? No. 360 for the whole damn bag. <clears throat> mm. Oh. It's okay. Vegan and nut free. I don't know how you're gonna be not vegan or nut free since it's popcorn. So it's made in a peanut, tree nut, egg, and dairy free bakery. I hate freaking thingy. I'm gonna chuck them at people. The nut, the kernels, I can chuck them at people. I can do that. I'm small, they don't notice and they don't see me coming. Pretty sure that's how I know what you did last summer started. Oh yeah. Mm. No, they ran somebody over. I was joking, babe. Oh. oh. Mm. Right, well, so what did you think of lunch? Well, the sandwich was gross, but mm. Mm, my pot of is delicious. My lunch was good. Sushi. I'm gonna eat this whole goddamn bag, aren't I? Probably. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna check these curls up, people. This one's me. Ooh. Uh oh. Oh. We got Dutch Brothers. Okay, let's try this. I hope this doesn't taste gross. What did you get? Strawberry watermelon Dutch soda. I'm not mad at it, but it's not as good. The heck are you drinking? Well, I like Antonia's watermelon. I thought maybe strawberry watermelon would be awesome. Maybe if you would have asked for actual strawberries. Do they have actual strawberries? It's not just syrup? Well, it's the syrup with the strawberries in it. Oh. Uh... Because I've had that before by mistake. I didn't know that they had the one with the fruit. Your island box. You can only have one drink. One uh, drink that's not like in a box. You know what I mean? I'm torn between sugar free peach rebel, sugar free tiger's blood rebel, my peach kiwi dutch soda. I would probably be my black tea with vanilla. Well, really? You haven't had that in a while. Though. I know. I think I'd probably just go for the tiger's blood. Sugar-free. Sugar I feel like the regular Rebel's too sweet. I don't like those ones, We still have a lot of food. I know. I still haven't even touched that damn popcorn. Nope. We still got two bags of Oreos. Oh, yeah. I still have two bags of uh, Nutter Butters. Okay, you can only have one type of cookie. Can that cookie have different flavors? No. <laughs> it's either the regular Oreos, the other flavor Oreos, or Chips Ahoy, or your Chasmin, but maybe. Biscoff. Which one's Biscoff? The cinnamon one that you don't like. Oh. I can eat it plain, I can eat it dipped in ice cream by itself, I can make it into a crust, I can ground it up and put it on my granola. I think I would go Oreos. It's probably the pistachio one, because I do love that one. Okay, we are just about home. Need to exercise when I get home. All right, we are home. Well, thanks for coming. We'll catch you all on the flip. Okay, let's get you. Yeah, let's go.